Hello everyone, my name is Yevke. The Absence Projector Professional Tool is a free software dedicated to our range of high brightness laser projectors. It makes it easier to set up multiple Epson high brightness laser projectors and offers many other powerful features such as automatic geometry adjustment functions. These automatic functions require the projectors to have an internal camera installed. For models that do not have internal camera, like the Epson EBPU series, an external ELPE C01 camera module can be attached to the projector. In today's video, I will share with you how to use ELPE C01 external camera module with Epson's Projector Professional Tools software to perform the following automatic functions. First, geometry corrections assist for tiling. Next is screen matching. And lastly, geometry corrections exist for stacking. Before we begin, we need to ensure that the ELP EC01 external camera model is properly attached to the projector. Refer to Guide to Installing ELP EC01 Camera Module onto Epson Projectors video for the step by step instruction for EBPU 1000 and EBPU 2000 series. For the EBPU 2200 series, you will need to attach it on front side of the projector. Remove the external camera cover. Remove the external camera fixing mount and attach the ELPE C01 external camera module. Connect the USB cable to the external camera. Place the external camera. Remove the front slot from the external camera cover and attach back to the projector. Geometric Corrections Assist for Tiling allows users to easily create a large seamless image from up to 15 projectors when projecting on a flat screen. By selecting the appropriate edge blending setting and adjusting the appropriate size and positions of your projected image, the projectors automatically combine these images and correct the image shape. To perform geometric corrections assist for tiling, first, ensure that all the projectors are on the same network. Group the projectors you want to tile. Make sure that the projector model supports the tiling function. Select Edit Group under the Layout or Monitoring tab, then enter the group name. Select Tiling and Stacking Settings. Specify the projector's positions. Ensure that the layout of the projected image matches the layout of the projector panel on the computer. Once that is done, click on OK. Next, enable edge blending. Go to Settings, then Edge Blending. Select Blending. Enable the side you are blending, then set the blend range. Next, adjust the positions of the projected images by using lens shift and zoom until they overlap. Select lens control under the settings tab, then select the projector that you want to adjust on the bottom left of the screen. Using the adjustments options like zoom and lens shift, adjust the screen until they overlap. After adjusting the positions of the projected image, select Camera Assist. Under the Tiling section, select Start. A pop-up will appear for you to confirm the projector's detail like IP addresses, 
project the name, and so on. Select Start again. Ensure the blue mark T is within the yellow frame. If not, use Lens Shift to bring it into the frame. Once that is done, click Next. The calibration will begin and will take about 5 minutes. A second pattern will appear. Adjust the grid lines to ensure the corners are square. Select a button from 1 to 6 and adjust the corresponding corner, then click Apply. A final pattern will appear to ensure that the two images are overlapping correctly. Once you have successfully tiled your image, you can use the screen matching function that allows you to automatically correct differences in the tint and brightness among the projectors to optimize the display quality of the combined image. You can directly proceed to screen matching after your tiling adjustment has been completed by clicking Proceed to Screen Matching. Alternatively, you can go to Setting tab, select Image, and choose Screen Matching. When prompted to select the master projector, please select the projector with the lowest brightness. The screen matching procedure will begin to make color uniformity adjustments to ensure consistent image quality and color uniformity. The entire process will take about 12 minutes. Please note that this function supports up to 9 projectors maximum. After the adjustments are completed, you can choose to apply the adjustment or revert to the previous setting. Geometric Corrections Assist for Stacking allows users to easily create brighter image by overlapping the images from up to six projectors to project a single image. Same as the Geometric Corrections Assist for Tiling functions, all the projectors should be on the same network, then group the projectors you want to stack. Select Edit Group under the Layout or Monitoring tab, then enter the group name. Select Tiling and Stacking Settings. Specify the projector's positions. Ensure that the layout of the projector image matches the layout of the projector panel on the computer. Once done, click on OK. Next, you will have to adjust the positions of the projected images by using Lens Shift and Zoom until they overlap. To do this, select Lens Control under the Settings tab, then select the projector that you want to adjust on the bottom left of the screen. Using the adjustments options like Zoom and Lens Shift, adjust the screen until they stack. When projecting to a screen, be sure to project larger than the intended screen size for both projectors. Now, the stacking can begin. Select Camera Assist. Under the Stacking section, select Start. A pop-up will appear for you to confirm the projector's details like IP addresses, projector name, and so on. Click Start to proceed. Ensure the four corners of the rectangular projection patterns overlap. If it, it doesn't, use Lens Shift to make the patterns overlap. Once done, click Next. The Geometric Corrections Assist for Stacking function will begin and will take about 5 minutes. Do take note that the master projector should be the projector with the highest brightness. A second pattern will appear. Adjust the grid lines to ensure the corners are square. Select a button from 1 to 4 and adjust the corresponding corner, then click Apply. A final pattern will appear to ensure that the two images are overlapping correctly. Do take note of the following condition 
when performing the geometric correction axis function. In conclusion, the Absence Projector Professional 2 software with ELPE C01 camera module can automate the whole setup process and make it up to 56% faster. I strongly encourage you to utilize the automatic functions when doing multiple projector setup and adjustments. Thank you.